But instead of uh, putting the slats straight up and down, like, like everybody does, the slats straight up and down, I'm gonna do something a little different. Ain't never going back. Today I'm out here, I'm working on a project for the investment property that we have and kind of spruce it up a little bit, change the front of the house, make it look a little different. Uh, today I'm going to make a, uh, I've, I've put some posts in the ground over there and made a frame for a fence, a little short four foot fence that divides the two neighbors. So, but instead of uh, putting the slats straight up and down like like everybody does the slats straight up and down i'm gonna do something a little different and i want to show you how i made it like this is going to be the inner wall it's right here and if you notice these slats they're not straight up and down they're going kind of in a slanted slanted way and i want to show you how i'm doing that because i always want to do something different sister cowgirl says hold on this camera's not steady that's really not steady. But anyway, Sister Cowgirl says she wants to have something that looks a little different than everybody else. So today I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna take this board and make slanted slats like you saw on the other one. As you can see, I've already burned the wood to give it that little, you know, burn look. But you're not gonna see this part anyway because the slats are gonna go over the top. But the reasoning, the reasoning that I did that is so that you know over time in the heat and the cold wood kind of i'm gonna put the slats real close together like that but over time wood seems to kind of open up a little bit so when it opens up you won't see white you'll see something that looks just like what's there so we're gonna get started i want to show you how i make the slanted wood uh check it out so never know you may want to do this yourself all right Okay, the first thing you want to do is find some wood that will go slanted. You're going to put it instead of instead of putting the wood straight up and down on the board like this, you're going to take it and slant it. I've already cut one little piece and put it up against it like that. And the next thing is you're just going to trace the edges from here to here and over there from there to there. And that's it. Then you start going all the way down the line just like this until you have a board that's finished like that one over there. So here we go. Check it out. This is the way we do it. Okay, the first tool you're going to need is a pencil. You got to have a pencil. Line it up. Make sure that this is covered from this end to this end. Take your pencil, go to the bottom, line up with this, and you're just going to trace it. get to the edge. Go to the next side, do the same thing. And then when you turn it over, there's your line. You can see it, there's your line right there. And on the other side, there's your line right there. Kind of hard to see because I've already burned it, but your line is going from here to here. And then you just cut it off. So here we go. Clamp it down real good. Make sure your clamp's out of the way. Make your cut.
that's your first cut and then you just repeat all the way take the boards all the way across all the way repeat until you're finished Thank mm -hmm. you.